What up everybody, this is Carlos, the Texas Squeegee, and I'm back. All right, in this video, I've got this Nissan Infiniti right behind me. Now this one has dealership tint, but we're taking it off and replacing it with the most advanced nano ceramic tint in the world today, and show you guys back home the difference between heat protection in dealership and nano ceramic coming up next. Squeegee that. All right, so now we're gonna do the heat test on this dealership tint. Right here, I've got it placed on the glass. Now this right here is what's gonna put out the heat. This little meter actually measures it. So the higher the number, the hotter it is, the lower the number, the less heat is getting through. Now this is the before. Before we do the heat, the heat test on the nano ceramic, I'm gonna place it right outside so that it's stable on that gasket. We're gonna put this meter right in here. And this is the number that we're getting through. The sun will do about 250. This is what we're getting right now. So we're gonna take this one off, replace it, and then do a side-by-side -side comparison to show you guys back home the difference. All right, so now that I just tinted this one right here, so we're gonna do the heat test afterwards to show the difference between nano ceramic versus the dealership tints. Now I got the same heat lamp right here, meter and everything like that. I'm putting it out here to stabilize it. And you can see right there, now we got like super low digit numbers. So a lot less heat is actually getting through. All right, so now on to doing the rest of them with this type of tint. Why? Why? I was steaming it off and I got happy because I was like, all right, it's coming off. Little did I know, there's another film on here. So, these removals um, on these rear uh, windows, you gotta be very patient um, because you can damage these defrosters. So midway me putting my hands right here, I noticed because anything right here, I could have on my belt. I really could scratch. So the dash towels that he bought or the towels are really cool. Just a little magnet, a little magnet. Cool. And it's just stay in place for me to be able to do my job the way I could. All right, so at Texas Tent Masters, before we deliver the vehicle back out to the customer, we actually have a system for ensuring the quality of it. One of the things that we do is we, pre we do use a premium conditioner on all of the door panels in case there's any little bit of water drip or water marks. This one pretty much shines it up, brings it back out. It, it revives that color, makes it look really, really nice so that we turn the vehicle back in looking better than when it was brought back in. One of the other things that we do, it's very unique, that's something that we do here in the shop, is that we do a heat test. We work with energy efficient films, so meaning like ceramic tint and stuff like that. We do heat tests on them to show you the actual numbers that your glass will be reading once we do the ceramic tint on there. We include that as part of every part of the install. We include a glass cleaner so that whenever you want to clean your glass, it's safe for tinted windows and it won't damage them over time. Okay, so we're here after we finish doing the window tint on this 2020 BMW and we're gonna do the heat test. Now this right here, we're using a 250 watt infrared lamp. This puts out the heat and this meter measures the amount of heat. So the higher the number it is, the hotter it is. So the lower the number, the colder it's gonna be or the less heat that's getting through. So I'm gonna turn this thing on right now. We're gonna get a reading with just the meter itself. This won't read past 600 uh, units. To give you reference, the sun will do about 250, 275. So that's putting out a ton of heat right there. And I'm gonna to try to keep it basically the same, putting it through that tent and then bringing it back out. So over 600, it's getting pretty hot right there. Putting it through that, the nano ceramic tint, we're bringing it down to double digits. So this right here got the nano ceramic 30% on the front doors. We went a little bit darker on the back ones, but the purpose of this one is just to show you guys that this doesn't have to be super dark and it blocks out a ton of heat. This is the most advanced type of window tint you can get on your car for maximum heat protection and UV protection as well. Actually, you know what? We're gonna go outside and do an actual heat test with the sun using this little meter to show you guys back home with the real deal type nano ceramic tint can do.
All right, so now that we're outside, it's super sunny right now. We're in Houston, Texas. This sun is really, really hot. Now I'm gonna show you that guy's a meter right here. So we're measuring the sun. I'm pointing it right at that sun. So they're by reading at 247. Now we're gonna take that same sun through this window tent right here. Down to 12, 13, double digits, almost down to single digits. But when we bring it back out to the sun directly, 227. So if you're standing outside, imagine what this is gonna feel. When you get the nano ceramic tent, boom. 14. All right, so now that we've got the car outside, what we did with this one, we did a 30% on the front two doors. Now this is the darkest that you can legally get here in Houston, Texas. On the back windows, we did a 20%, which is a slightly darker version. You can actually see how your vehicle will look like tinted when you go to our website at texastintmasters.com. We have a tint simulator that you can pull up your make model of the vehicle with your color. Experiment with how your vehicle will look tinted all before you ever even set foot here in the shop. So if you like this video, you want to get something like this done, visit us at our website at texastintmasters.com or follow us, like us, leave your comment down in the comment section below. This has been Carlos the Texas Squeegee and I got to get out of here, man. This sun is way too hot. I'm a tinter, so I'm not really used to this. So see you guys on the next one. Squeegee that.